Huh? What is it now? Wasn't the game supposed to have started already? Yeah, well, yes. But the junk press broke down, and we thought we'd use the time for a little tutorial. Who thought that? I don't need no stinking tutorials. So how are you going to fix the junk press? Just watch me and learn. Maybe you want to listen to what I have to say first? But you don't have anything to say. Oh, come on. It won't be long. Just point the cursor at me and left click. We'll see about that. Computer, talk to Wenzel. You don't have to say that explicitly. Um, who's talking to you? Why, you are. You clicked on me. Smarty pants. Just tell me what's wrong with the junk press. And stop wiggling your feet. It's pressing only very gently now and doesn't really squish sufficiently. Hey, every idiot can see that. Well, why don't you present the tutorial then? Okay, piece of cake. But first, I'll explain, um... How to look at an object. I know that. I see. And how? I point my cursor at it and right-click when I see the eye icon. Well... The theory is easy, but how about the actual practice? Hey, this is your tutorial. You're a cop-out, but be that as it may, I'll demonstrate. Uh, do you see that little uh, thingy on the floor over there? I will now use the um, tongue icon. The eye icon. Yeah, I will now click on it, thusly having a look at it. So you better watch closely. I thought you wanted to have a look at that thing on the floor. I can see it. It's lying there. I mean, look more closely. You just point at it and right-click when the eye icon appears. What's that? It's a cathode plunger. Thanks for the input, Wenzel, but I recognize a hydro clamp duplexer when I see one. Too bad I can only look at it. A duplexer like that could be useful. You can pick it up. You just have to point your cursor at it so the hand icon appears. If you left-click now, you'll pick it up. There has to be an easier way. If you say so. Okay, I picked up the duplexer, but what am I supposed to do with it now? You put it into your inventory. That's where all the items go. You picked up that object. Now you can open your inventory by simply clicking on the handle in the upper right-hand corner. Hey, there it is. Correct. This is your inventory. Yeah, I knew that. It's where you can see what you're carrying around. You still know how to do that, don't you? Look, Wenzel. I'm almost done. Impressive. But I mean that. Huh. It fits. Now you have to... Hey, you don't have to spoon-feed me. I'll manage the rest. If you say so. Uh, Rufus, there's one more thing. I told you I'd manage without your help. Now, all I have to do is press this button here, and right away... Oh, how I love tutorials! Whoa! What the? The toothbrush bailed out on me. Guess I should have kept it in a more germ-free environment. Attractive color mixing. <laughs> Let's get rid of this thing.
Uh, seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. <laughs> I guess these will make good provisions for the journey. Huh, not a chance. The handle is missing and I can't get my fingers into the cracks. <laughs> now the little bugger's in for a surprise. Come on, brushy, brushy, brushy. Come to Papa. Ha! Gotcha! Ha! Gotcha! I'll make you suffer the next time I brush my teeth. There. Too bad the two directions of the control stick are blocked, but who needs those anyway? The main thing is that the crosshairs are right on the tracks. And then I'm gone. Ha! <laughs> this will be a walk in the park. Just light the fuse, and boom! Well, that should be it. Stand by, Wenzel. Nice parrot. Yes, we use it to detect dangerous fumes in the mine shaft. Oh, what do you do when that happens? We get a new parrot. <laughs> I see. Huh, this is a map of the trash tunnels. I'd better ask Hannock how this all works. Hello, Hannock. Oh, hey, uh... Rufus? Exactly. Why aren't you working? You mean, why am I doing just the same as you? Because some joker removed the magnets from the detonation plan, that's why. Hey, I am very busy, actually. I've been running around all day, getting things done, and, uh, picking stuff up, and, 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 and things like that. Well, how about you find some new magnets for our detonation plan? Then we can finally continue work. How exactly does that detonation plan of yours work? Well... That's pretty exciting, actually. Yeah, I doubt it. The chief detonator uses magnets to mark the positions of the next three planned detonations. Then he rings a bell, and I give a signal to the miner who will on his part prepare the explosives in the mine shaft. And after that, we blow the thing up. <sighs> and then you start with the exciting part? Um, no. That's it, actually. Yeah, <laughs> I knew it. Huh, this is a map of the trash tunnels. I'd better ask Hannock how this all works.
Oh, the blast signal. Take cover! Imminent blast! A pinch of black powder. One whole chili. Stimulant. I'll call this blend Rufus Reckless, the Maiden Slayer. <laughs> or Savior. Hmm. No, Slayer sounds much better. So, I have the powder already. Uh, what exactly am I supposed to do? It's all written down on the recipe I gave you. Just bring me everything that's on the list. Till then I'll do some fine tuning on the espresso machine. Okay. I'll be off then, getting all the ingredients. You do that. I'll be here if you need me. Cool. I already have the special water at least. Into the tank you go. Well, that's it. I found all the ingredients. Wonderful! I can't even tell you how excited I am to see what happens next. Y but I thought we were making espresso. Yes, you are right. This is an august moment, my friend. We shouldn't spoil it by worrying about the pressure within the nuclear core structure. Pressure within the nuclear core structure? Hear me, gods of our forefathers! Using just the most refined ingredients and the highest possible compression, we beseech thee, open the gates to the Espresso-verse! Holy smoke! More pressure! More pressure! Okay, uh, okay... Are we... are we dead? No. Being dead feels completely different. Ugh. As you know, I have gazed deep into death's eyes more than once in my life. Oh, now that you mention it, that reminds me. Is Tony still wearing those contact lenses? Shh! Something's happening. Ouch! Whew. I think this brew is gonna do the job. Right, it should shift back a gear. Come on, kitty, kitty, kitty. 
<laughs> I like how it's all relaxed now. <laughs> right, it could really speed up a bit. Come on, kitty, kitty, kitty. Hey, hey, hey. the coffee makes it work faster. <laughs> I should apply for a job as producer for a video game developer. I've got these gift vouchers from Tony's shop. Gift vouchers verified. One light lead weight from storeroom one. Supply your address now. Where, where, where to? I mean, what? I, I, I don't know. That's a good question. Address verified. What? Dispatch initiated. Postage being scanned. Error. Error. Postage paid is two times less than it should be. Dispatch cancelled. Please place new order. Well, the pigeons get their bearings from the planet's magnetic field, right? So, let's see what happens if I start fiddling with this a bit. <laughs> I love to play God. I'll leave it like this for now. Maybe this helps. I've got these gift vouchers. I have to think fast. What? Oh. Oh. Imminent flash! Now as it is written our hero was smitten and rescued the maiden from impending doom. On a horse made of steel, evil guys on his heels, he rode with a girl into dawn's early gloom. She awoke by his kiss, well at least more or less, and the whole part concerning the uppercut scare can be pinned at least to some extent on her damaged brain and plan. Anyway, in a big picture, who's gonna care? Who's up? Who's gonna care? What a pain in the... Ooh, you really could make yourself a bit lighter, you know? Araba, slopa baba. Yeah, yeah, you don't say. From bad to worse, where are we anyway? Hey, that's the old junk mine rail system. Back in the day, it was used to transport heavy loads to the lower ascension station. Oh, sorry, babe. Don't take it personally. Now, I just need to find some kind of rail car and a way to get goal on it. Let's go!
Let's give it a try. Whoops. Oh, it's always the same with these uh, ravioli inverters. I, I hope it's still functional. Oh, where's it gone? Oh, there, and there, and there, and here's another part that looks the same. Damn, what's supposed to be a part of it and what isn't? I can build a power inverter in my sleep. Off into the inventory with it. I wonder if I can assemble a second one. Not bad, Rufus. You're a natural. I'll just assemble the third one real quick. There. <laughs> I bet the doc couldn't have done it as brilliantly as me. Obviously, I don't want to invert this. Not again. I thought you were making yourself extra heavy when I lugged you up the hill just now. Never mind. The controls are exposed, and there's a circuit diagram. This'll be easy as pie. Yeah, now we're really going places. Check it out, babe. Oh, Rufus, you really are the best. True, so very true. <laughs> if you like that, then you'll love what's coming next. Oh, yeah. Look, the rails are still warm. Oh, 
Hey, I'm still alive. <laughs> I'm not an easy man to break. <laughs> they call him Rufus. Rufus. And what a sight. The Lower Ascension Station. Ah, I did it once again. You see that? I did it. I, I, I. Oops. Maybe I should get you to a place that is a little more comfortable. Luckily, it'll be a downhill ride from here. So, do you want to be carried? Which would be plain boring. Or, do you prefer the fun and fast way? Yeah! Historians would die for a way to decipher Apparently missing text passages here They still found no reasons why scratches and lesions Related to gold subsequently appear But then why should it bother you? For he finally managed to haul her more or less unharmed to the rendezvous spot And that was without expecting any pay Except for the reward for It's not about the context to so get on with the plot Huzzah, get on with the plot Well, you'll be safe here for now. We just need to wait for your fiancé to show up. <laughs> that Cletus guy is really a lucky fella. I hope he'll keep his promise. Well, now we just have to wait. I guess I should search for a way up to the platform on top of the tower. The view should be good from up there. Chewing gum, and fast! <laughs> What? Hmm. I want chewing gum. Huh. Voice control seems to be broken. Hmm. Must be empty. This doesn't say anything about flavors. There's a dancing cockroach depicted instead, with a hat and a cane. <laughs> That's stupid. This doesn't say anything about flavors. There's a dancing cockroach depicted instead, with a hat and a cane. <laughs> That's stupid. Hmm. I'll keep the rest for later. Much later. There's something behind it. What the? A plug? Oh, man. Not really. You crazy? It can't be that easy. Ah! A one fish of the day, please. Ugh, I should have said which day. Yummy! Skewered anchovies. They had those when I was a kid, too. Wow, exactly those. Any foodie knows anchovies get better the longer they're stored. Mm. Oh, I wanted to have with the stick anyway. You don't even taste the sugar. Now it's set to calzone. My dad always told me life is like a calzone. 
Only those who chew thoroughly will notice the rat's teeth. Now it's set to phosphor. You could read in the dark on the toilet after eating that. Whoopsie daisy. The switches change the lights. There are three on this side and one on the other. Ha! One off, two on. I'm getting it. Three and three. That's six, isn't it? What if I calculate cross totals? I have to think binary. It's impossible that these levers don't have any significance. It's simply impossible. I'll get there eventually. I have to think binary. I'll get there eventually. I've had that before. I have to think binary. They're all prime numbers. I have to think binary. It's impossible that these levers don't have any significance. It's simply impossible. It's impossible that these levers don't have any significance. It's simply impossible. They're all prime numbers. I'll get there eventually. It's impossible that these levers don't have any significance. It's simply impossible. They're all prime numbers. It's impossible that these levers don't have any significance. It's simply impossible. They're all prime numbers. depicts the upper class leaving the planet. The lower class remains behind. Whoa, those guys are really fed up. They shout at the traitors and shove barbecue lighters and sausages on giant forks in their faces. Must have been Barbecue Thursday. Only mud and dust. That's all I can make out. Before I get to work here, I sh Ugh, did I really say that just now? R U F E that wasn't it. Maybe this? R U Nah, I've tried that. But what else could it be? Mosaic depicts uh, a bunch of little guys. They seem to be building something. 
The raggedy clad little guys carry giant steel girders up a steep ramp. The fancily clad ones stand at the side and design fancy ornaments. Hey, that's the Ascension Station, the departure to Elysium, and I'm there too. No, don't! You'll hit the reactor and there'll be a nuclear time loop! How can I prevent that from happening? You can't! One of us has to sacrifice himself! Rock, paper, scissors. Damn! Cool! I can't believe I'm doing this. I hope the historians will never learn about this bit. <laughs> Crap, the mop broke. <laughs> what an unfortunate occurrence. Mosaic depicts the cable boat leaving Deponia, just like I will be doing soon. And hey, hey, hey! Someone has scribbled something on it. It must be the password for the elevator. At least, it's written right over the picture of the elevator clock, exactly where a piece of the mosaic is missing. Crap. He is not man enough to do that. Once Goal sees his true self, he'll lose everything he tried to achieve. He'll never take that risk. Congratulations, Rufus. You did it. Just insert the backup cartridge and you can leave. Elysium awaits you. Back on Elysium, I'll give you a nice back rub, okay? I guess so. Come on, don't make such a gloomy face. In a way, it's a good thing that our inspection was without results. Although, I can't remember everything. Or was there something else? Um... Come on, how about a bit more enthusiasm? Towards Elysium and all that. Yes? No? Um... What's wrong? Is there something you'd like to tell me? Aren't you happy to be going back to Elysium? I am. It's just that... Well then, towards Elysium, right? Say, Goal. Yes? Um... Well, it's like this. I'm all ears. Well... What are you stammering about? Spit it out. It's just that... You're beginning to scare me. What's wrong with you? All right then. I'm going to tell you now, but you have to promise not to get mad. Why, Cletus? Why would I get mad at you? Calm down. Relax. Relax.
bags. Some con man erases my memory, poses as my fiancé, and almost gets me involved in it. There. The course is set. Next stop, the floating black market. Good. Great. Fine. Are you all right, Rufus? You sound all tuckered out. You didn't finish telling me what happened up there on the tower. I don't want to be nosy, but... Uh, is Deponia safe? That's out of my hands now. Now look at you startled, the brain implant cartridge has not been swapped, which was all part of the plan. The world has been rescued, that he did detest, who'd have guessed, I attest, you'd have done just the same. So if you still want to force me to do stupid chores, like washing the dishes to the trash and such, you'll just prove that you haven't paid attention to what I said. The message at its course like, huzzah, as a rule. Huzzah, the chorus guy's rule. Oh. 